All right, so this is group three's final project for CECS 525. We've elected to make an LCD status display for the Pi. We've got two buttons here that'll move backward and forward between the screens. And we've got a couple of buttons down here at the bottom that will either return to the home screen of the current mode or it will change modes. If you change modes, you can go into a Twitter mode, which will take a given Twitter account and cycle through the tweets with the forward and backwards buttons. And right here we've got a shutdown button for the Pi. It will begin a shutdown process and then alert you when it's actually safe to unplug the Pi from power. And here we've got the status display itself. This is the home screen. This screen displays time information. It's got the day of the week, the date, and the uptime of the Pi. This screen will display various CPU information with a little status bar at the bottom telling you the total percentage of CPU usage. This screen will display the memory being used. It gives you the total amount of memory available, the amount of memory you have free, and the active and inactive memory. Here is the home screen of the Twitter mode, and we'll just cycle through a few tweets here. And if a tweet is too long for the screen, it'll actually just spill over into the next one before starting another. And we'll go ahead and hit the shutdown button really quick. So it's shutting down the Pi now. And in just a second, it'll tell us that we can unplug the power. Let's go ahead and show you that the Pi is indeed shut down with the lights off. And as you can see, there is no activity light. All we got to do is unplug it.